Hey guys, hey guys. So for every setback, there's a comeback. For every setback, <clears throat> there's a comeback. Every setback, remember that guys, I, I live by that. Every setback, there's a comeback, right? <clears throat> but here's the thing. <clears throat> when you achieve something, guys, go reward yourself, okay? So I like Rihanna. Perfume. It smells very good. I love the way it smells. Love it. So when I feel accomplished, guys, I go buy myself some perfume, some smell good perfume. Smelling good make you feel good, right? You're not walking around stinking, right? You know, smell good, make you feel good, right? Right? Another accomplishment, guys, right? I bought me a Louis Vuitton wallet. It's like $1,000, all right? Another accomplishment. Now, my husband actually bought this for me for Christmas, but here's the thing. I would have bought it for myself, even if he didn't, guys, right? So this was a, what, $1,800 bag? $1,000 wallet, right? And Rihanna, I think this is like $50 or $40. I think this was like $40 or $30. Whatever, right? Whatever it is, okay, guys? Reward yourself, guys, so that you can know that you're worth it. See, what I realize with women is that, you know, we depend on a man or outside validation to, uh, you know, make us feel good, guys. But the reality of it is, you know, we can make ourselves feel good, okay? We can reward ourselves by taking ourselves out to dinner, right? Spending $100 on ourselves, Right, going to get our nails done, going to get our hair done, just spending some alone time, going to buy you a Louis wallet, going to buy you a Louis bag, going shop for some smell good perfume or a new watch. Right, reward yourself, ladies. Never look for outside forces, uh, you know, to for validation. Don't look for a man to validate you and say, oh, I think you're beautiful. Tell yourself you're beautiful every day or day. Reward yourself if you made an accomplishment. If you lost 10 pounds, right? Don't go out to eat and get ice cream and cheesecake and shit. No, go go buy you some Rihanna or some Gucci bamboo. That's my next one. You know, Gucci bamboo uh, uh, perfume. I think it costs like one, what the lady said, 130, right? So that's going to be my next perfume. So reward yourself, guys, because when you smell good, you feel good, okay? Then if you have another accomplishment of, you know, I want to get to $1,000 a month in my business, now, guess what? Get to $1,000 a month. Guess what? So now you can save up money and get you a Louis Vuitton wallet. Right? Then, then you scale up. Then my goal is $5,000 a month. Now, you can walk in the Louis store and pay you $1,000, pay you your $1,500 cash for your bag and not be front and doing it. Not a fake Louis. Right? This ain't fake, baby. Okay? You know, people... You know, trolls on YouTube I might say it's fake. All right, but it's not. All right, guys, reward yourself. This leather is feels so good. Okay, reward yourself, guys. You are worth it. I tell people this every day. You're worth investing in, and you're worth, uh, you know, uh, you know, uh, you know, having, you know, nice things. You're worth rewarding yourself. You're worth the investment. Invest in you. Invest in trainings and courses and mentors and books and seminars. Guys, you are worth it. Right? I remember one of my mentors told me that, right? I didn't believe that shit at first. My mentor told me, he was like, you know, you're worth it. You're worth, you know what I'm saying, being able to, uh, you know, spend a thousand dollars on yourself. You're worth it, right? So, guys, you got to think that you're worth it and start saving up your money. But also, too, make, make a goal. What is the goal to accomplish? And then go reward yourself. One of my mentors, she buys her David Yurman bracelet every time she reaches a milestone in her life. And she done reached three milestones in the last two years. So she got three bracelets right now. So you got to reward yourself, guys, because this is how you know you're moving. Right? See, people just buy a whole bunch of bullshit. Right? People just buy shit and buy shit and buy shit. And it don't mean nothing. See, this wallet means, you know what, Tanisha? I've arrived. That's how I feel. I, I was able to purchase me a thousand dollar wallet with no problem. That's what that means to me. So this is not just, oh, I got a Louis bag. Oh, I got a Louis wallet. Let me flash it all over social media. No, because it is not flashed all over social media. This is an accomplishment for me, right? I was able to spend a thousand 
on a wallet, right, with no problem, walk out of their cash and still have money. So I feel accomplished, right? Being able to buy this. So what if it's $40, $50, guys? When I was broke, I couldn't afford a $50, $50 perfume, right? Have $100 in my wallet, right? I couldn't, have, I couldn't afford that, guys. So you start to appreciate life more, right? And thank God for my husband, all right? Bought me $1,800 bag, all right? Did he complain? Maybe he did. But like I said, guys, whether he did it or not, I was going to do it myself. Okay, he bought the bag, I bought the wallet. Okay, so make everything an accomplishment, guys. That's why you got to make life living fun and not like uh, like you strapped and in bondage and you bonded. Guys, reward yourself for every milestone. You know, you hit 10 grand a month in your business, reward yourself. Put it on your vision board. When I hit 10 grand a month, I'm going to buy me a Benz. Put that on your vision board. When I hit 5 grand a month, I'm going to buy me a Louis wallet. When I hit five grand a month, uh, you know, I'm going to buy me a David Yurman bracelet. I'm going to buy me some diamond earrings. So you got to set goals. Sometimes this stuff is foreign what I say because we're not used to hearing this, guys. That's why I tell people, subscribe to my channel. Keep listening to me because I'm going to help you change your mindset for real. I'm going to help you change the way you're thinking about yourself. Every accomplishment, guys, even if it's small, pat yourself on the back. Buy you a new book, right? Invest in you, right? Because this is investing in me, right? A lot of people say, yeah, that's investing in me. But I also would spend 10 grand on mentors and books and seminars and trainings also too. Not just spend 1500 on a bag or $1,000 on a bag. I spend, I spend $1,000 to go to an event to meet with millionaires so they can help me grow. So reward yourself, guys, always. But always invest in yourself, too. Okay, guys? Reward yourself always. But invest in yourself, too. Okay, guys, so hopefully this has helped you, okay? Because you deserve to win. But you're not going to win, guys, losing. Okay, guys, get the guide to prosperity. All right, it's a link below. The Guide to Prosperity. Get the ebook and get the hardcover. Get the ebook, guys, and get the hardcover. Get the ebook, my friend, and get the hardcover. The Guide to Prosperity. I'm going to promote this book, guys, for the rest of the year. So you will either get it <laughs> and start reading it and be like, you know what, Tadisha, this book is changing my life, right? Or you're going to get tired of hearing me talk about the Guide to Prosperity, guys, because everyone needs it. Everyone needs to know how to live prosperous. So click the link below, guys. See you soon.